A new high-tech manufacturing center set up shop in Central Texas. This facility will bring robotics and artificial intelligence startups together to develop innovative new technology. KXN's Sarah Alshes shows us the space currently under construction and explains how this could help with workforce development in our area as well. A 50,000 square foot space dedicated to creating new technology and manufacturing. Which is going to have a whole row of robots. Students can learn and train and become robot operators. Located in East Austin along the State Highway 130 corridor. <laughs> Construction started on the Hayes Innovation Center for Advanced Manufacturing. People to come through, be inspired, and you know, leave knowing more than they did before and with a brighter outlook on what they can do. HiCam Executive Director Marcus Metzger says this will serve as a co-working space for startups, providing them with the equipment to develop their own technology. Companies that are working with robotics, they're working with next generation additive manufacturing, which you can think of as 3D printers, but on a really big scale, AI. For manufacturing. HiCam partnered with downtown co-working space Capital Factory to help find those startups. It's helping to bring manufacturing and high, really high-tech manufacturing here to the U.S. and here to Texas. Another focus for the center, workforce development. It'll offer an educational program where students can learn how to operate robots and 3D printing. Our first goal is to create 150 new advanced manufacturing jobs in the East Austin area. Our other goal is to provide workforce training for a thousand people over the next three years. So you can come here and know nothing about robots and over the course of eight weeks gain the skills so that you can become an entry level operator. Sarah Alsheh, KXAN News. And the center plans on opening up at the beginning of 2025. Later this year, it will open applications for manufacturing and robotics startups that want to be located in the space and participate in its accelerator program. I'll give you some added context. While manufacturing continues to grow as an industry in Central Texas, particularly with chip makers, other sectors still dominate. To give you an idea, last year Central Texas housed more than 2,200 manufacturing locations. That's good for the 12th largest sector of the local workforce with roughly 78,000 jobs. Experts tracking this information show current job postings for the manufacturing sector in the last month have increased 2%. It's what's inside that counts, even for robot. AI is the brain, robotics is the body. Now those members of the University of Texas Robotics showcasing their creation outside of the annual State of the University event. The university just created this new program for freshmen to offer an intensive way to study, create, and research next generation technology. We wanted it to be a cool cohort-based program where students get to experience robotics in all forms. So they get to live together in a living learning community, they get to do research together their first two years through a freshman research initiative stream, and then they get a minor in robotics. And you can find this program as part of the College of Natural Sciences.